here's why Citadel customers are on the verge of losing everything. If you guys have not heard about this whole situation going on yet, please listen carefully. Citadel customers are in for a massive shakeup entry in 2022. The hedge fund just updated their liquidity terms for all investors, and the institution continues to lose money on bets they're not willing to close. They are limiting the quarterly withdrawals to 6.25%, meaning it would take 16 quarters or 4 years to fully pull out. Unless Citadel Securities closes their heavily shorted positions on both AMC and GME, clients are in for some more losses leading into 2022. Should clients pull out their money, or start to at least, it's definitely worth considering. Citadel gives a desperate ultimatum to customers. The funds are currently closed to new investors, so if, if someone quits, they might not be allowed back in in the future. The hedge fund has given the desperate ultimatum to its customers in efforts to hedge against losing bets. Citadel Securities has lost billions of dollars all year, betting against AMC and GME. Retail investors have been fighting for this adversary from trying to bankrupt two of America's favorite companies. The hedge fund has been notoriously short in AMC despite all talks of bankruptcy officially off the table since 2021. Citadel is not stopping despite billions in losses and it's costing their clients a lot of money. Now Citadel Securities is making it tougher for clients to withdraw their investments. Citadel will eat every single one of their clients' dollars to fight the retail investors. Should clients pull their money out of Citadel? Citadel Securities is one of the largest hedge funds in the world. They've created a massive systemic risk though for the entire U.S. economy, some would say. The list of hedge fund short AMC stocks are right here and they're playing with their customers' money. They're not looking for hedge funds to play with their money. Most of the public is not. They are taking accountability and researching where their money can grow both short term and long term, which is what the retail investors should be doing best. But if you want to stay up to date with everything else that's going on with AMC, because trust me, there's a lot more to go through, make sure to please subscribe to my channel with notifications turned on so you never miss out on a video. Also, drop a like on this video for some good luck moving forward for AMC. And lastly, go to the second link down below in my description and join my private exclusive Discord server. Thanks as always, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.